Welcome back everyone, Brad Shishin here with more Terraria. I've nearly finished off the uh, Tower of Heaven. This is the top part of it up here that I thought looks really, really cool on the map. Um, as you can tell, I'm wearing iron armor, but the reason why I started recording now was be not because I've almost finished it, but because right down the bottom it said the Blood Moon is rising, which kind of scares me a bit because that means zombies that can actually break through my doors if I'm correct. Yeah, see, they can open up doors now. So, um, I'm glad they can't figure out ladders. I mean, ropes. So, for now, I'm lucky. <laughs> I mean, I can just stay in here for as long as I want to, really. And I don't think I don't think I can take anything. Oh my god, there is a ton. Like, I could go down there and slay them, and I kind of want to. Just don't have anything to reach them right now. I need to get them outside, so I can use the Sky Tower and get them outside. But, um, I started doing the chain link thing. I was going to do that, like, to make it look like it's stable and whatnot, but uh, I never actually finished that off. So I'm going to destroy a bit of the wall here and glide my way down to safety. I wouldn't really call it safety, but you know what I mean. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Zombies, you have messed with the wrong person. I don't know what actually happens during a blood moon, like what special things happen. I don't think anything special really happens. I think it's just a large influx of zombies. I could be mistaken though, I could be wrong. The only problem is my stars keep spawning inside the uh, building. So unless I like kill them over here. A top hat zombie! The groom, come here. I want you. I don't know why I want you. You have a lot of health. Give me a top hat. Give me a... Yes! I got a top hat! Woohoo! Oh crap. Um, Cole's in trouble. That's typical. Oh no, they left Cole alone. Huh? Let's go, Cole. Yeah, you zombies uh, mean nothing to me right now. Oh. Oh, and I got a grappling hook. I actually made a grappling hook, by the way. I didn't actually get a chance to say that before. Yeah, this is this is easy now that I've got the star fury and everything. Hey, Mr. Bobblehead. Um, well, more than we say. I don't know whether I mentioned this. I also have. Uh, I think you guys saw me pick it up. The brisk Hermes boots. Uh, that gives me speed run essentially. As long as I'm on a flat ground sort of surface, so that's pretty cool. I never actually really had a chance to use them though. Because you have to be, like I said, on a flat surface and all that. Come on, let's get them in more of you. Yeah, it's not even midnight yet. But I got a top hat, I mean... Who cares about anything else right now, really? Where is that top hat? There you go. Vanity item. And social. Now I am a guy with a top hat. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the tower's coming along nicely, like I said before. Something I've been working on a little bit. I think I've spent about half an hour almost on it. I was collecting a lot of resources in between the last play and now. Simply getting all the stone and everything required. Like down here, I've dug here as well. And a little bit to my left, if you can see that. Or is it, uh, down here, I've dug out all the stone as well. So, yeah, I've been doing quite a bit. I mean, there's not more of them. They're just too scared. <laughs> I think the groom was meant to be the main part of it. Though that doesn't seem right to me, that was the main part. Because it's just... It's easy. Now, I figured there was going to be like a big zombie right at the end. But then again, it is only midnight, so... Speaking super soon, I guess. I guess this episode might just consist of me fi- Oh, a shackle! Oh, more zombies as well. Can you leave what's-his-face alone, please? I knew I should give him a seat upstairs. Oh well.
I like how I can kind of focus on the mobs outside as well as the ones on the inside. Just because of the whole star theory thing. Like, I can go and get this guy out here whilst focusing on guys in here. God damn, I keep missing. Oh, it's facing the wrong way. Hold on. Oh, the zombies in all the world. Da, 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 da. Oh. oh I kind of just ran into that one. Actually, um, so let me go away for a second. Let me just check this shackle thing. Defense. And 20 mana. Cool. Mana, sorry. I keep saying mana now. This game just makes me want to say mana. I don't know why. Yep, hold it. <laughs> hey, zombie. What you doing down there? I want another bigger zombie. He doesn't want to give me any big zombies, so he just wants to give me normal zombies. I like how the water's blood red, though. That's really, really kind of. That's really cool. Oh, hi, more zombies. Yeah, blood moons aren't as scary as I once remember them being. Maybe because it's got a. Or maybe could have this up there. Maybe it is because I have the Star of Fury, but it, either way, it's still leave him alone. <laughs> yeah, it's it's just it, it's so much easier. Now. Oh, another green one! Yay, competition! Maybe I don't know. He died really quickly. <laughs> oh. Come on, please be a, a boss or something at the end. Are there more zombies? I can hear what's his name dying. Leave my house alone! Yeah, so far I've lost 10 health. Well, actually, it's, it's regenerating, so. I'm just mowing through these guys. Oh wow. More inside the house? Nope, not yet. Almost over. I think. Where's the moon? I don't know, I can't see the moon, but it seems like it's getting brighter, so it might end any second now. Come on, please be a boss or something. You at least need to send me one of them. So far, no bosses though. Actually, something's attacking. What's his face? Oh god, hi. Not to say his goal's coal is going to be a big loss or anything, but. Oh, another groom. Where's the bride? It's, it's the setting groom. Unless groom means something else that I don't know of. Death to you. More? Yep. <laughs> that looks more like a skeleton than a zombie, though. Is that it? Oh, I stole one. Hi. Hi, bud. <laughs> um, I think that's it. Can't tell the time. It looks like it's getting brighter. And, yep, there's bunnies. So... Ah, well, you guys saw me survive a Blood Moon with ease, but uh, yeah, so that was that was fun. So I thank you guys for watching me. I'll finish off this tower and everything now, and I don't think there's a little bit more to do up here. I'm not entirely sure what I can do up here. Let me guys know if you guys want to see anything interesting being added to my house. Actually, have I dove this way before? No, I have not. That will make for something interesting, wouldn't it? me jumping out of my house. Let me use my, um... There we go, I just jump off, off here. And away! And I shall end the episode once I hit the ground. I just want to see what's out here, to be honest. I don't think there will be anything. Though, if, if I do hit something, that, that would be awesome. 
Nope, I didn't think I would. I think I'm way too low now for anything to be here. And this is the easiest way to check for um, our beings. Well, actually, the easiest way would to just be to build a bridge the whole way along, but uh, I figured this would be easy for me as well, just to jump off my tower. And that's as far as I can get off my tower. Wow. That covered quite a lot of ground. And as you can see, like that whole map's reveal, and if there's anything I kind of missed in the corner of my eyes, it would be right there. Like, there's a whole black spot there. I might check that out later. But yeah, there's my tower of heaven. I don't know why I like that name. If you get the reference that I'm making, um, leave, leave a comment down below. But uh, in any case, I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching.